In this video, I'll show you how to fix Bluetooth not working in Windows 11. If you found this guide useful, then please consider subscribing. And once you've done that, then please consider leaving a like. And let's get right into this guide. I'll be explaining basic and more advanced fixes in this guide to make sure you watch the whole thing. Firstly, just make sure that your Bluetooth is properly turned on. So firstly, go and open up your settings. To do that, go and tap on the Windows icon in the taskbar like so, and go and tap on settings. If you haven't got this app here, then just go and tap on search and type it in. Then once your settings load, all you need to do is go to the left hand side and tap on Bluetooth and devices. And on this page here, there's going to be a switch, which you need to make sure is toggled on. And there's also going to be an add device button, which you can go and use to go and add devices. So make sure that it's switched on. If it's switched on and it still isn't working, then let's get into the next fix. What you need to do is open up your services. So to do that, go and tap on search and type in services, just like so it should appear. Then I'm going to go and zoom in on this for you guys, but what we need to do is scroll down and locate Bluetooth. As you can see, here it is. We've got three different options. This is in alphabetical order, by the way, as well, so it shouldn't be too far down. Now, what you need to do is make sure this is set to automatic, all three of these, because as soon as your computer launches, you want Bluetooth to be available. At the minute, it's only set to manual. So let's go and set this to automatic. To do that, click on it once, then right click on it and go to properties. And then where it says manual, click on there and put automatic and then tap apply and then go and tap OK and go repeat this for all the others as well. So right click properties and change it to automatic and apply it. And one of the most important ones is this final option here as well. So make sure you go and set it to automatic and then tap apply and then go and restart your computer and then it should be running. So now go and see if your Bluetooth is now working and if you can go and connect to devices. However, if you still can't, then what I recommend doing is running a troubleshooter. To do that, just go and tap on search at the bottom and type in troubleshoot and go and tap on troubleshoot settings like this and wait for it to load. And then what you'll need to do is go and tap on other troubleshooters and wait. And then what you'll need to do is scroll down and locate Bluetooth in the other section. It should be quite near the top, hopefully. If it isn't, just scroll down and go and tap on run like so, and just follow the troubleshooter instructions. And hopefully the troubleshooter should go and fix your problem and go and provide some solutions. However, if it goes and says Bluetooth is fine, then it may be a problem with the device you're connecting to. So make sure that the device is properly turned on and also that it's got like pairing mode enabled as well, so your computer can go and discover it. But there we go, guys. I hope one of the methods in this video did work for you. If they did, please go down below and consider leaving a like. Peace.